Report. Source 2 version of CSGO set for release with Counter-Strike 2 beta very soon. Counter-Strike 2? Hey, remember that game? Jeez. Yeah. What's That's, going on here? It's still huge. Counter-Strike. Never faded. No. Can't it's kill a classic. Big. I know a couple of friends who still play it. This is like... Did this start the whole thing in terms of war-style shooters? Yeah, tactical. I'm trying to think if anything predates it. Like, certainly there wasn't any... What year would the original Counter-Strike have come out? Um, let me see. There's probably something, that pre probably something that predates it, but might not have been as successful. 1999. 1999. Wow. I think there was something before that, though. 99. Just guessing. Was it called SWAT or something? Yeah, maybe. But anyway, this thing has been, has really hung in there as a competitive title, as like a reference competitive title. Yeah. And I suppose anytime you're updating anything like this, you got to be super careful to satisfy the enthusiasts. Uh huh. So, what kind of changes are we talking about then? Uh, Graphics. I'm Following guessing. years of leaks and rumors about a version of CSGO on the Source engine, files from NVIDIA driver update at the end of February showed a CSGO o Go S2 executable. This is the first concrete indication of a Source 2 upgrade for Counter-Strike with the latest entry in the series. The beta for Counter-Strike 2 using the updated Source 2 engine is due to release as early as this month. Hmm... Speaking on condition of anonymity, sources with knowledge of the game's development told Richard Lewis that the Source 2 version of Counter-Strike had been a priority at Valve, with one quoted saying, the big priority is getting this out and then polishing it, fixing any bugs, and bringing it up to the level people expect from CS. It'll boast 128 tick servers at launch, a feature heavily requested from CSGO players. An improved matchmaking system is planned to lessen the need for third-party matchmakers like Faceit and ESEA. This is uh, uh, way beyond my uh, expertise. In my this current in my current involvement in this. I know it's it's still a regular competitive game, so Very it's so important that it functions almost like an OS. It, it that that yeah. that it is rock solid from a stability standpoint. And how are they going to pull like CS:GO players to? CS2. What remains unclear is how the new release will be integrated with the hyper competitive top level of CSGO and how it might impact the current skin economy. Oh my god. Oh yeah, what happens to my skins? Whether the new game will continue to exist separately from CSGO. It's like, you know what it reminds me of? The Ethereum fork. <laughs> like, yeah, as loyalists. What happens to the old chain? Uh, as we've seen with previous iterations, or if we'll see a merger similar to Dota 2's Source 2 version. It's unknown. Wow. It won't be a new game. It won't be Counter-Strike 2. It won't be even a rebrand. Just CSGO Source 2, and your skins are fine. They'll be available in a new version. All right. Well, that comes from Twitter. So Maybe just a bit of an upgrade. Maybe you're all good. You don't need to worry about your the skin economy. 